Hi there, everyone. This is Jana from Duo Fantasie, and welcome to the mini course of how to play the flute. So if you're here, two things are true, I think. Uh, you have a flute lying around at your house, and you don't know what to do with it. So um, this course is exactly for you, just to understand how to start playing in 14 days, with some minutes only every day, so nothing Nothing much to do, just uh, have a little fun and learn a new skill. And congratulations on doing that. I'll be speaking to you from different beautiful concert halls around the world. Of course, only virtually. As you can see, this is the Berlin Philharmonic, my favorite. Acoustics is just awesome. Playing in there, listening from everywhere, you can hear very, very well, every instrument, um, and also playing in the middle of the orchestra, you can hear all the other sounds, just uh, as if you were next to each of them, it's wonderful. And yes, so let's get started right away. Congratulations again, and let's see how to get started with playing the flute. I have to get mine, just here, I hope you can see it, because they do not really allow other articles here you, here we go so if you have a flute case like this opening up is easy you just have to push them to the sides and then you open it up see and there it is um there we go i hope you can see it yes so it comes in three pieces as you can see and um, there is one piece with a huge hole in it that's the lip plate and that's the head joint then we got the body which is the long piece behind here and the small one which is this one it's called the foot joint okay as you can see mine has three keys down here so it has one more than yours probably because this has a b foot it goes down to the b yours will stop here i guess and go down to the c c foot Okay, so how do those work together? Well, um, you can't actually get it wrong because it's only one way that they will fit, but you need to pay attention to not touch the mechanic uh, very harshly and keep the fl flute in a way that you don't go against the keys as the mechanics is very, very sensitive behind here. So let's see, put this one together taking it on the downside. And uh, actually, they do not go like this, as you would think, but you'd have to put this one a little bit further in front. As you see, like in the between, it depends on your hand, a little bit further, um, maybe in the middle of the hole or a little bit further back like mine because I have very small hands. Then you put the hat joint on top and do this as well. And let's see how this fits. Actually, this hole needs to be in line with the keys. Uh, I'm hoping you can see it. Uh, I need to get a little bit closer. This is too far out. The hole has to be in line. Uh, there you can see it with the middle of the holes on the keys. As you see, my keys have holes as well. Otherwise, you, you have circles in the middle where to put your fingers. And now that we have put it together, let's have a closer look. These holes are more than our fingers. Uh, actually, the holes not, but <laughs> the keys. And they work together in a fascinating way. The, the actual way was um, constructed in the middle mid um, 1900, uh, 19th century, sorry. And it has a fascinating mechanical way. Our fingers are not long enough to close the actual holes where they are all. So they needed a mechanism to do that. If I touch this one, for example, it closes the hole up there. So I would not be able to close this one and this one down there contemporarily. So my finger goes here in the middle where there's no hole beneath and closes the upper one. This is all done, as you can see, by connections and um, yeah, putting tension to them so that they will stay open. As you see, the holes are open. And you just 
change the length of the tube of the flute by closing those holes. And that changes the sound, right? Now, for tomorrow, I wanted you to tell me, look at your flute, and find the four keys that do not close but open when you seem to close them. This one closes actually, see, this one closes as well, this one closes as well, but there are four keys that open the holes. Can you find them? See you tomorrow.